right, we are back breaking down the 49ers highlights that they posted to their social media platforms to provide a little bit more context from what we saw in practice today. We're going to slow this one down because this was a Brock Purdy dart. Look at that. See what you're not really getting a beautiful angle. And I had a phenomenal angle of this throw. I was off to the left uh, of this shot. And I got to see the whole thing break down. Look at that ball placement. Brock Purdy sitting in the pocket, delivering a strike to Brandon Ayuk. Look at Oren Burks. I mean, I originally, when I saw Oren Burke, because you can see Oren Burks' hands go up to catch the ball. I thought this was going to be an interception in real time. I was like, because of his reaction and how early that Oren Burks was going to try to pick this thing. Look at the margin of air here to get this perfectly on the upfield shoulder of Brandon Ayuk. Do you see where the ball lands? The ball placement right in the bucket on the upfield shoulder in between the safety. This is a highly good a difficult throw but just a good throw by brock purdy this definitely was one of my favorite throws on the day from brock purdy this was one of my favorite i think this was the best catch of the day from danny gray danny gray has really been ascending these last couple practices look at him rise up high point i mean that's some hang time right there from the speedster danny gray proven he can do more than just run nine routes this is a phenomenal effort by danny gray to go up and get a pretty high pass uh, from sam darnold look at that squaring up to the ball watching the ball into your hands fantastic and we got some trey lance darts trey lance looked pretty darn good on the day and this is another example of that trey has done a really good job of these kind of Deep, deep outs, whatever you want to call them, corner posts, just throws that are like 15 to 20 yards deep downfield or beyond and outside the numbers. I mean, talk about a perfect pass. That ball couldn't be any better placement. And you can see the bit of the layered nature to it to drop it on the other side of the linebacker and in between the cornerback. And shout out to Tay. Is that I'm pretty sure that's Tay Martin? Shout out to Tay Martin, um, second year wide receiver, former undrafted free agent, has been doing a phenomenal job in training camp, even took some first string reps today. Uh, Kalen Leborn, uh, right here, has looked really, really good in practice. Um, again, no Elijah Mitchell today, no CMC, so heavy workload from TDP, Leborn, and um. Jordan Mason and all all those guys have looked phenomenal. Uh, Layborn looks like a guy who could be on NFL roster for sure. So it's going to be very interesting to see what the 49ers do with him. Um, and this was the Trey Lance interception. Um, Trey was really having a good day. Uh, this was really his big, the only real blemish that I would consider. I mean, he didn't. He had a miss on some other throws, but this one, it f he felt and looked confident in the pocket, and then he let it rip, and it just went straight to D. Winters, the rookie linebacker who has also been a riser these last couple days of training camp. D. Winters has been a guy who's been flashing quite a bit also, look at, is that Deshaun Jameson? Deshaun Jameson looks quite upset. Do you see as he puts his hands on his head? The re Why would Deshaun Jameson be upset with his teammate getting an interception? Well, based on the way he jumped this route, you see the positioning of him. I think he thought he was going to get an interception. <laughs> so uh, I think that's why you see the hands go on the head. You know, one of these actions like, oh, because kind of got a little maybe a little interception taken from him i don't know but again trey lance was pretty good on the day uh that was really just the the one miscue and uh that would that would be a wrap for the shorter 
Uh, definitely a shorter highlight tape today. Um, but uh, some quality plays out there uh, by by all quarterbacks. Uh, all quarterbacks weren't perfect on the day. And again, it's really rare, in my opinion, for these guys to come out and be perfect on the day. Um, I think the best run of the day was actually TDP. TDP had a phenomenal run, stuck his foot in the ground, uh, goes north-south. TDP also beat Talano Ufanga to the edge on one particular play. TDP is a guy to stand, uh, pay attention to. But overall, uh, players looking good on the day. Uh, practice continues to be competitive. And we got a lot of risers uh, showing up in training camp for the San Francisco 49ers. Uh, if you want to see more training camp content, you already know what to do. Smash the like button. Hit the sub button. Make sure you got the noti bells on. Also, shout out to the 49ers for these quality, quality clips. And uh, appreciate everyone who has been following along the journey. Make sure to like and subscribe for more updates.